Come on. So, this is getting irritating now. This whole piece here runs all the way down to the floor. Is apparently, well, it's it's got to go in before the headliner goes in because it this goes up like that, and the headliner goes over the top of it. So I got to have this done first. Something else to stop me. But I can't figure out how the stupid things comes comes out. I'm gonna try not to destroy it. <clears throat> But I am losing my patience with it. <clears throat> Maybe I'd be better off if I destroy it. I gotta make up my own way of doing it. <clears throat> Seriously? There you go, there you are, come on, come on. Ow. Those nails are still sharp. Ugh. I'm in a bigger persuader. It's moving. Oh, shoot. Look there. Yeah, I know. I should pull the seat out. I don't want to. It's bare. What's going on? Oh. It's got little little stud sticking out and this piece here has got little sockets that fit inside it, little crow's feet. <clears throat> You're gonna fight me all the way, aren't you? Huh. They don't know it yet, but I'm gonna win. Jeez, Louise. So I really want to get this headliner put in. I'm just getting irritated now. Uh, one thing, uh, one thing after another keeps stopping me. Uh, so this piece has to go in first, and it's something I got to make. And this is kind of metal. The, cloth that goes over it, this piece is metal, and it's got these little catches in it, here, that hook on these stupid little pins, and of course the bottom of this is kind of rotten, so I'll have to do something about that, <sighs> it ain't getting easier, that's for sure, so Let's get to fixing it, as little as I want to. Not a whole lot of options at this point. Well, the other side wasn't too bad. I was able to take care of that one. It was fine. And this one I'm gonna have to reinforce. Maybe make a new piece. Up to here or something. Uh, let's see what we got. So, 
I got this piece to cut for that. You gotta roll those edges. Because it needs to stand up that high to be able to cover the wind lace. So I'm going to have to clean that up too. if anybody else uses these. This is not a wire wheel. It's like an abrasive wheel. They're not cheap. They're like 12 bucks. But boy, they last a long time. Now this is that same piece. This is the piece I took out of it. This goes down to the front. This goes to the uh, passenger, front passenger door here. And those pins come through these holes. One here and up. And this goes around that one section. And that's up to the top. And the wind lace is sewn to it. So I'm going to try to reproduce that. Make a pattern out of this paper here. Okay, there's my copies. Now I didn't have any... This is kind of almost like an oil impregnated fiber board someplace. Probably chipboard. I didn't have anything like that. But I did have an old uh, treadmill uh, roller. That ought to be plenty tough. So, 
I just hope I can sew through it with the old dinosaur machine. Well, here's one of these pieces. I got them both sewed up. The little anchors come through there. And it actually goes, it actually goes that way. That goes over one door, and this one goes over the other one. goes on first and this fits on there I got two radiuses up here and that fits in there Should work. I guess we're going to find out. So, I got that one installed. I think it looks pretty good. A couple little wrinkles out of there. Maybe it'll come out. It looks fine. Now I can proceed. So, of course, I got this far and realized I ran out of short staples. So, I'm off to the hardware store to get more staples. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it, everybody. Take care. Next video, I'll be getting this headliner, and finally, <laughs> can't wait.